Hey everyone, welcome back. Do you have a dream to study abroad, particularly in Germany, and you do not have enough funds to support your education there? Then this video is definitely for you. We are talking about the incredible opportunity of fully funded study in Germany on the prestigious DART scholarship. In this video, we will explore what the DART scholarship offers, who is eligible, how to apply with a practical example and the life changing benefits that it brings. So let's get started. So what is the DART scholarship? The DART scholarship, which stands for German Academic Exchange Service, is a world renowned scholarship program funded by the German government and it aims is to support the international students, researchers and the professors who wish to pursue their studies or research in Germany. So let's talk about the benefits of the DART scholarship. One of the most appealing aspects of the DART scholarship is that it is fully funded. It covers all the major expenses that comes with studying abroad from tuition fees to the monthly living stipends. For example, if you are a master's student, you will receive 934 euros per month as a stipend. And if you are a PhD student, you will receive 1200 euros per month. And if you are a postdoctoral uh, candidate, then you will receive 2000 euros per month. Other than that, you will have a health insurance and even travel allowance. In some cases, uh, DART scholarship also supports or also gives you the family allowance to bring your spouse. So that's also a very unique aspect of this scholarship. Moreover, DART scholarship ensures that the financial worries do not hinder your academic pursuits in Germany. Now let's talk about the eligibility criteria. This scholarship is open to all the international students, particularly from developing worlds who want to pursue their graduate studies, doctoral studies, or even postdoctoral research in Germany. Specific eligibility criteria may vary depending on the scholarship type, academic level, and the field of studies in which you want to apply. Generally, strong academic performance and the relevant qualifications are essential. Plus, uh, proficiency either in English language or in German language may require depending on the chosen program. Here, I want to emphasize that you will not specifically need IELTS or TOEFL exam to apply for this uh, scholarship. So, what are the types of DART scholarship? Actually, DART scholarship offers a wide array of scholarship program to cater to the various academic needs. Whether you are interested in undergraduate studies, master's degree, or a doctoral research, there is likely a DART scholarship that aligns with your academic goals. They even have specialized uh, scholarship for subjects like engineering, arts, and social sciences. So you just have to explore their official website to find the best uh, program that suits your uh, academic uh, history and uh, for your future goals. Now let's have some tips for a successful application. Indeed, the competition for the DART scholarship can be intense. So here are some tips to boost your chance of success. First, thoroughly research the available scholarships and choose the one that aligns perfectly with your academic aspiration. Second, prepare your application to showcase your unique strengths and demonstrate how you can contribute to the German society after the completion of your uh, study. And finally, seek a guidance from mentors, professors or previous DART scholars who can provide valuable insight and feedback. You can even write uh, your questions in the comment section. I will try to answer. 
So how to apply for this scholarship? You have to submit an online application through Dart portal. You will need to provide academic transcripts, letter of recommendations, uh, mainly two, but in some programs they ask three uh, from your professors or from the uh, workplace. For example, if you are working, you can ask uh, this letter from your manager and uh, a convincing motivation letter. This is very important document toward your selection. So. Uh, pay attention when you write so the recommended length for this letter is one page to three page and if required uh, you have to give the language proficiency certificates for example if your graduate studies uh, 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 were in english medium then you just have to ask your university to give you a letter that mentioned that your previous education was in english language that will be enough you will not need IELTS or TOEFL uh, to apply for this scholarship. Make sure to keep an eye on the application deadline as they vary depending on the scholarship you are applying for. Now I will show you how you can explore uh, a scholarship in your field of studies on their official websites. Let's go there. So this is the official website for Dart scholarship. So you can see here uh, different countries. So you have to find out your country. For example, here I can see Argentina, Australia, uh, Bangladesh, Belgium, Brazil. So for example, I am from Pakistan and I will search it here, Pakistan. So here we can see India, Iran, Indonesia, Italy, Israel, Jordan. So here we can find uh, Pakistan so after finding your country you just have to click open website so when you click on it uh, you will land on this page so this particular website is giving us the opportunity only for Pakistani students uh, under the DART scholarship program so you just have to go through your own country website for DART and there will be uh, definitely some scholarship opportunities for you. But uh, uh, for each country, uh, DART scholarships, number of scholarship and the type of scholarship may varies. So in this video, I'm going to particularly uh, explain the DART scholarship program for Pakistani students so at the moment for Pakistani students, uh, DART is offering master's, PhD and postdoc uh, scholarships. If I want to explore the master's scholarship, so here is the list. Uh, the first one is development related postgraduate courses. They are very famous and uh, here mainly the engineering students can apply definitely and uh, it stands for epos the duration of the scholarship is one to two year and the deadlines varies from program to program so in this video i will mainly focus on this uh, program how you can apply on that but other than that there are many other uh, scholarship but those scholarships are subject uh, specific for example this helmet schmidt program it is for the students who study public policy and good governance there is another uh, scholarship particularly for the architecture people so similarly there is uh, this uh, long list you just have to explore and find out uh, according to your field of studies uh, which scholarship is aligned with your uh, previous educational background. So this is for the masters. But if we continue scroll down this website, here we have the PhD scholarships and here we have all the offered PhD scholarship uh, list through the DART scholarship. The first one is the DART research grant for doctoral uh, programs in Germany and it is for three years. So if you are interested in, you just have to click on that link here. You will have all the information related to that scholarship. So you just have to explore all the list. And if you are a postdoc uh, researcher and you are looking for 
opportunity to to have a research uh, uh, exchange in Germany then this is a definitely a great uh, platform for you as well so you can have a research grant for uh, one to six months or one to three months again you just have to explore these uh, links in front of each opportunity so let's talk about the one for the master's students that is the development related postgraduate courses so you just have to click on epos so when you click on it you will land on this new page okay so here you have uh, the brief overview so who can apply the graduates with at least two years of professional experience in the field of studies is required to apply for this uh, scholarship and other than that you must be uh, or you must belong to the list of eligible countries so when you click on it the eligible countries here uh, you will have all the list for example i am looking for pakistan so i just have to go to south and central asia here i can find afghanistan india nepal sri lanka pakistan so we are here so we are eligible to apply for this uh, scholarship and what can be funded duration of funding value so all these things i already uh, explained in the introduction of this video uh, you just have to go through uh, all these uh, sections for better understanding so here is the application uh, deadlines so depending on the chosen uh, study program please check the scholarship brochure or the website of your chosen uh, study program application documents what are the application documents which will be required so here uh, the first one is the dart scholarship application form you just have to download it so when i click on that uh, here i will have this uh, dart scholarship application uh, form you just have to fill out this form and you have to submit this form along with your application okay so the second thing is you have to uh, have a Europass uh, curriculum vitae, I mean Europass uh, format uh, CV. So if you do not know how to prepare Europass CV, I already have one video on it. Please uh, uh, just check the description of this video and uh, follow that video to prepare Europass CV so another important document is letter of motivation with detail a reference of academic professional and personal reasons for applying for the program i already mentioned that you can apply maximum in three courses so you have to give the detailed reasons for your choice of courses and the priority in the letter of motivation so you have to submit uh, a, only one letter of motivation to all the postgraduate degree program of your choices other than that you will need the employment letter or i will say the work experience letter uh, you will need the proof of language uh, skills for english IELTS or toefl or in some cases uh, a letter from your university letterhead will also work uh, but if you are applying in German courses, you will need a uh, German language certificate. Uh, you will need uh, your transcript and uh, uh, higher education degree certificates. So these are the documents that you will need. So now how you can apply for that? So the application and the selection procedure is like that. Step one, you send your complete application directly to the according uh, postgraduate course then a selection committee suggests the potential uh, candidates for dart scholarship the suggested candidate will be contacted by the dart uh, officers to upload their complete application to the dart portal so the selection process will be finalized and the suggested candidates will be informed accordingly so here it's a very important point when you are going to apply make sure that you have a copy of each document of your application ready 
as those documents in the form of PDF files have to be uploaded to the Dart portal in case you are suggested for the Dart scholarship. So, uh, in other words, uh, how you are going to apply? First, you have to go to uh, this list of uh, the courses for the next intake 2024. For example, I am a chemical engineer, so I can apply here sustainable renewable energy technologies. Okay, so this is the complete list of courses under the uh dart scholarship for the intake of 2024 here you just have to find out the relevant course according to your uh, previous education so engineering and the related sciences so i'm going to apply for example uh, sustainable renewable energy technology and uh, the university is uh, the university of uh, uh, Odenberg the course is being in English language and uh, the duration of course is 24 months and the deadline to apply for this course is 15th of October 2023 okay so this uh, is the uh, very first step that you have to take and then uh, when you select your program you have to click on this link and it will directly take you to the university website okay so you have to come on the applications so again here you have all the uh, information or all, all the documents that you have to submit uh, to apply for this uh, course so if you are applying for the dart scholarship then they are again helping you out here so when applying for the DART scholarship, please send all the required documents in the requested order as listed on the checklist as one PDF file to following email address. So you just have to prepare uh, all the documents and just send that uh, uh, documents with uh, a very nice written email on this web address. So if you are uh shortlisted for the dart scholarship then you have to submit the same application to the dart portal and when they obviously ask you so the deadline for the winter uh intake that is 2024-2025 is 30th of september 2023 okay so i hope you understand the method to apply for this uh scholarship that's all for today's video. So if you have a dream to study in Germany, then this fully funded DART scholarship can make it possible. Apply, embrace the opportunity and watch your dreams come true. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more valuable content. Thank you for watching and until next time, keep striving for the excellent. Good luck. Bye bye.